The Edna Weekers Arts in Wisconsin Award seeks to enrich cultural offerings and inspire future artists in Wisconsin communities underserved by the arts. The award supports faculty or staff in the creation and or presentation of new or existing artworks across the state. Aristotle Georgiades, Art Department. I'm Aristotle Georgiades, I go by Eris. I've been at the university for like 17 years. I teach sculpture and sometimes a public art seminar. And I have a practice of doing both studio sculpture and public art. I collaborate with my wife under the name Actual Size Artworks. Well, this award I submitted mostly because I wanted to curate or organize a sculpture exhibition that I've done in the past that gives advanced upper division students and graduate students an opportunity to actually build a, a piece of sculpture or installation art and uh, display it in an outdoor setting with thousands of people to get to see it at the uh, UW Arboretum. I do public work and I like the work to reach a broader audience than maybe just a high art audience. It's been successful and the students really get uh, a great experience out of it. It begins their professional practice. The exhibition is in coordination with the blooming of the Longnecker Gardens. So some people are a bit surprised when they see sculpture in the midst of these beautiful blooming trees. Having the opportunity to apply for research funding through graduate school or through the Arts Institute is a real gift. And I don't take that lightly. You know, in these kind of political times in the state of Wisconsin, it can be quite difficult to do public work. The Arboretum has given us that opportunity to work out there. Students begin to understand working in the public, having to make projects that can stand the weather, that are safe. Sometimes people see those as compromises, but it's part of being an artist in the world. Ages ago, when I first became a professor, I felt a real responsibility to be a spokesperson for visual arts. Sometimes issues come up and they direct questions from the press or something to you. And so I have to be an advocate. I hope that, that Appreciators will also be advocates of visual arts, especially public art. You don't always have to like it, but uh, if nothing else, it creates discussion. I think we have to defend the ability for it to be there, those op opportunities. So I hope that um, art appreciators will stand up for this.